Hi guys, this is from NetbookNews.com. I'm over here at the uh, Freescale Suite in the Palazzo Hotel during CS 2012. I'm taking a look at their brand new platforms, and I mean quad core platforms. Let's see, IMX 6 series. And over here we have a little demo unit that is just showing you um, how a single core, a dual core, and a quad core CPU is handling different threads and how it's just uh, outsourcing it to the different cores over here now this is running um, the scroll website scrolling is running on a single core CPU and you can see that it does it almost 90% of CPU load and when we're switching over to a dual core all right, it's just kind of changing this a little bit it takes a while there you go now both cores are taking care of this website scrolling and of course with quad core this is another story this is just to demonstrate here why we really need uh, multi cores to handle this but what I really would love to show you is uh, how much performance the new IMX6 series offers you this is a little demo of um, the Unreal Engine and uh, this is running on a quad core IMX6 and as you can see, the uh, lighting and sh shaders and the textures this is absolutely brilliant. Uh, let me just go very close to the screen so you can actually see this. Um, wait, maybe there's some enemies around here so I can also show you explosion effects. Okay, let's see. I would say this is running at like 60 frames a second. This is like Okay, it's kind of hard to do this. Here we go. So if I compare this to um, the competitors, whether it's NVIDIA or TI or whatever, this seems to be very, very competitive. Super smooth graphics. And uh, there's another demo unit over here, which is running our familiar game that you can get on the Android market over here. I think for about a year right now, it's called Dungeon Hunter. And it's pretty much the same here. Unfortunately, I can't tell you anything about the resolution, but I would guess this is also like 1280 by 800. So this is also constantly running at like 60 frames a second. No legs at all. A lot of performance that the IMX 6 series is offering you. What about real products? Um, well, Frisco told us that we should expect some uh, tablets and based on the new IMX6 in the second half of 2012. And I tell you what, when I'm looking at this little graphic demo here, I just can't wait to get my hands on a final device. So this is uh, just a little impression of the performance of the new IMX6 quad-core series from Freescale and social for Thanks for watching.